All right, Denver's Union Station is set to come alive with all sorts of activity this weekend. The Free International Busker Fest kicks off on Thursday with a dazzling street performances of every kind. With more on what is uh, what is to expect is festival director Maya McCoy and my co-host busker Sam Malcolm, <laughs> who's also a juggler and a comedian, but you did a great job as a co-host. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, Maya, I want to start with you. What is Busker Fest all about? Well, it's one of the best events of the summer in Denver, in downtown, outside of Union Station. Um, it's on the plaza outside. It's going to have performers from all over North America. There'll be circus, theater, living statues, um, and it's really accessible for people of all ages. Um, yeah. Okay, well and then let's explain what busking is all about. Like, what is that? Yeah, so it's it's really street theater. Okay. And there, you never know quite what's going to happen because there's no walls. Um, you know, the audience is right there, live. Um, and at the end of the show, the performers will ask for tips. And that's how they are able to tour the whole world. And that's how they make their living. Yes. Wonderful. All right, Sam, now folks may recognize you. You're from Denver. Yeah, and but you're a juggler and a comedian. Yep. What inspired you to bring those two things together? You know, I just always really loved making people laugh, and I always thought juggling was just such a cool thing. And I was like, man, I wanna, I wanna take both of those, and I wanna put them together, and I wanna do a show that makes people from all over just feel good. And you've done it successfully. Like I said, here's some pictures of you downtown Denver. Yeah. Um, what do you like being, or why did you wanna be a part of Buskerfest this year? You know, I have traveled the world doing street performing festivals and doing events and I just I love it so much and I was so excited that there's something like this coming to Denver mm -hmm. and I really just wanted to take part in it I want to make it grow I want to see it turn into something amazing that everybody's proud of good for you can you tell us about the lineup who are we gonna see yeah we have uh, acts international acts we have some great acts like uh, we have Peter Irish who is the hacky sack world champion we have and he, he's actually another local, too. Wonderful. Uh, we have Tiana the Traveler. We have the Street Circus. Uh, we have the Gora Gora Orchestra. And uh, we also have Peter Rabbit, who is a wonderful bucket drummer. Uh, and he's like all these people are kind of coming in to take part in the busker festival and do great shows for yeah, people Yeah, true busker-esque yeah. Entertainment all right, you've brought um, some knives So I'm gonna be stepping out of the way, but you're gonna give us a demonstration on what yeah, you're gonna be doing I'll give you a couple quick quick tricks <laughs> if you'd like to see here. Sure. Oh, no, I'm gonna throw them <laughs> <laughs> You can in step that back. direction. <laughs> yeah, so just a few of the things that you'll see uh, we have these knives uh, and I could do a cool trick with them where I take the knife and I throw it under my leg. Oh my gosh. Yep, just like that. I can even do it across the face. Holy cow. And you'll love this one, across the other face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow. Favorite one is just a little fancy finish. How do you go from, wow, wow congratulations on that. That's fantastic. Success. How did you go from juggling balls to juggling knives? Uh, with great difficulty. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> graceful, graceful. Uh, Maya, what are t what time are some of the performances that we'll see? Well, we kick off on Colorado Day, so Thursday at 5 p.m. We go through the evening. We start fr Friday at 5 p.m., Saturday 10 a.m., all the way through the day, through the evening. Okay. And Sunday starting at 11. Okay. And does it cost anything for us to appear? Yeah. And kind of tell us about busker etiquette, if you yeah, will. Yeah, great question. Um, no, it's free to attend the event. Event, um, but bring cash because buskers will be asking for donations at the end of their shows and as I said before that's how they make their living yeah so really come out and support the busking fest and make it the best festival ever and outside of the street performers what else will be happening at the event uh, there are statues there's face painting there are stilt walkers Art Street, which is a local nonprofit, they've built these giant puppets in coordination with History Colorado, um, and they'll be doing walking about the plaza. Uh, there are art cars from uh, from <laughs> close by in Colorado. There you go, um, Trinidad. Okay, um, and so make sure to check out the whole event. There's a scavenger hunt that kids can do. Okay. Um, yeah, and something how, for everybody. How quickly? How how do we find out more? 
Uh, check our, our website or go to Facebook. Okay. Union Station Busker Fest. Maya and Sam, thank you so much. Thank you so much for Good having me. Good job. Us. Nicely done. All right, head down to the International Union Station Busker Fest this weekend. The fun starts on Colorado Day. That's this Thursday, August 1st at 5 p.m. There will be a grand parade where the public can meet the performers, so be sure to check that out. You can find more information online at unionstationbuskerfest.com.